No, it's not good. Oh, there you are, Charlie. Oh, oh hey. Uh, hi, 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 Jackie. Uh, what's, what's up? Not much. I haven't seen you around my butcher shop lately, but yet yesterday I noticed you had a barbecue. Oh, oh that, 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 that was a road kill. I, 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 hit, I, hit, I hit a squirrel. Oh. Really? Well, I found this in your trash, buddy. That's a pretty big rib for a squirrel. Uh -huh. <laughs> Jackie, it's your neighbor. You can't hit him with a bone. I saw him coming out of Red Pax's meat store yesterday. I am going to kill you with my bear, 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 a line. Hands. 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 <laughs> Uh, Jackie, uh, how about if I make up a cue card? Cue cards are for idiots, Laura. I'll just write the word in my hand. <laughs> What's the word again? <laughs> Hands. <laughs> Wonderful acting job out there, Jackie. I swear to God, you are the next Vic Tabak. Oh, yeah? I wish. All right, let's try this again. Uh, scene one, take nine. All right, audience, keep that energy up, all right? Now, we'll take, we'll take it from Sophie's line. Okay. And... Oh, but he's your neighbor, Jackie. You can't hit him with a bow. Oh, yes, I can. I saw him coming out of Red Pax's meat store yesterday. I'm going to kill you with my bear. Oh, can't. Oh. Charlie, come on. No, Jackie. Charlie? Charlie? And stay out, Charlie. Cut, cut. So, oh, stop. Hey, call 911. I saved the scene with that ad lib, I think. <laughs> Is he all right? I think he's dead. Oh, oh. So is this a wrap? <laughs> yeah, get me casting. <laughs> Starting Friday, buy a McDonald's Extra Value Meal and get an NBA Fantasy Pack free. Or pick one up for only 59 cents with any other purchase. Win NBA Fantasy Here prizes, go. like ball person for a day Here at next go. year's All-Star Game. Here you go. Thanks, Bill. Anytime, Michael. Hey, I'm one full-sized adult. So naturally, I'm big on nutrition. But there's something inside of me that still gets really pumped about frosting. But who's kidding who? This body's a shrine. And we don't put fat or salt in the shrine. I'm lighting up. Relax. With Kellogg's Frosted Mini Wheats, you can have it all. For the adult in you, whole grain nutrition, fat-free and no salt. For the kid in you, lightly frosted, great taste. Hey, I'm no dumbbell. I know what I like. The frosting. Switch to the big twin? Give me one good reason. I'm a big man. This is new? A twin for normal skin and a twin for sensitive, right? It was great. I'm a big man. A new Big Twin Select. Made a big man out of me. <laughs> Come on, Grant. This is not your fault. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. I wrote the script. I had him running around. Off your first actor, huh, Grant? Want me to <laughs> time into the hood of your car? <laughs> yeah, well, flowers would be great, yeah. Well, if they look real, sure, that's all the better. <laughs> well, great news. Since Charlie died right here on stage, our insurance is going to cover all our losses on the episode, and there might even be a little left over to buy mugs for everybody. <laughs> Doug, how can you be so callous? The man is dead. Hey, will you all just lighten up? I mean, you guys are the ones that told me that comedy is tragedy plus time. Well, it's been an hour. Hey, how's it going, Charlie? Let me out. I can't breathe. <laughs> oh. Hey, 
Harper, I got a great idea. Yeah. I want you to write a whole new episode showing me dealing with Charlie's death and how tore up I am inside, you know, because that's the kind of crap that wins Emmys. And you know what? We can actually use the scene of Charlie actually dying. Oh, such a great idea. What? Oh, no. Think of the ratings, too. In fact, we should have a camera going 24 hours a day over at Golden Palace. Jackie, Jackie. Jack, don't you think this seems a little opportunistic? <laughs> Damn right it is. And remember, it was my idea. Okay. <laughs> I can't believe the nerve of some people. Some ghoul has already taken Charlie's parking space. Yeah, that would be me. <laughs> Bobby. Hey, what? Come on, I deserve it. I'm the one who paid to have his car towed. <laughs> Hey, everyone, listen up. Y'all remember my buddy Bill, the drug addict? Hi, Bill. Bill just got out of rehab today. Third time's a charm, huh? <laughs> hey, oh, but this time it's gonna stick because he had to turn in his dealer to keep from going to prison. <laughs> hey, I'm on uh, Cops this Saturday night. <laughs> <laughs> hey, tell him what you said when I told you that Charlie died. Oh, don't you just hate it when your neighbors drop over? <laughs> He's so damn funny. That's why I want him to write the script where Charlie dies. You're joking, right? No, no. He knows a lot about death. Oh, yeah. I almost bought it myself a month ago. <laughs> Only I didn't see no bright light or nothing. Just a uh, big fire, a lot of people screaming, hollering. Oh, it's horrible. <laughs> Does he have a handle on this or what? Plus, he needs the money to buy into a bar in Colorado. Yeah. Excuse me. You just got out of rehab and you want to buy a bar? I'm a crack addict, not an alcoholic. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't know there was a pecking order. Oh, but Grant, there is. Jack, <laughs> don't do this. This is a slap in the face to struggling, dedicated writers everywhere trying to break in. You know, I, I worked at a car wash for five years, and I wrote, I wrote 20 scripts before I got my first break. What a coincidence, Jerry. Bill robbed a car wash once. <laughs> Twice. Oh, that's right, that's right. Too tough of a topic for a first-time writer to tackle. I'm sure he's written other stuff, haven't you, Bill? Oh, yeah. Bad checks. <laughs> Stay ready for the script, man. <laughs> we gotta get out of here, Bill. Come on. But, but Jackie... But... <laughs> hey, by the way, uh, when do I get paid? Yeah. Uh, right after you turn in your script. No getting around that, I guess, huh? No. Uh... Hey, uh... I gotta be out of town before my cops episode airs. Well, don't you want to stick around to see a taping of your first script? <laughs> Apparently, you never fingered a drug dealer before, Jerry. <laughs> Lined up there, Bill. I'm a writer now. <laughs> I needed something to write on. Plus, some of these napkins have jokes already on them. Oh. Well, if you need any help. Thanks. Hey, does anybody know a word that rhymes with aneurysm? <laughs> it doesn't have to rhyme, Bill. <sighs> That's good. This is uh, easier than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, Bobby, would you mind, uh... Change places with me. Oh, yeah. Sure thing, killer. That's not funny. God, I just, I hate this. This is a slap in the face to struggling writers. We all know the car wash speech, Jerry. Five years, 20 scripts, blah, blah. Yeah, yeah well, at least when I got my break, I was a damn good writer. It's not weird. <clears throat> Well, the point is, you didn't have to rewrite every word of my script. It's not like we're going to have to with this clown. That is not a good idea, Jerry. Last year, when Jackie hired one of his buddies to write a script, the head writer tried to rewrite it, and Jackie just fired him. I'm face it. We're stuck with whatever this guy writes. But he's not even going to be here on taping night. We'll just slip Jackie another script. I'll never know the difference. A great idea, Jerry. Which car wash should I forward your mail to? <laughs> Then again, every plan deserves a shot. Which one of you guys is going to write it? Oh, I think G -G Grant should write it. Actually, Jerry, I don't mind writing it. It might give me something to do to help ease my conscience over what happened to Charlie. Grant, are you sure you're not going to get any writing credit on this? I'm, not, I'm sure. Oh, I'm going to get smashed. 
How do you guys do this every day? <laughs> This will be very informal. Anyone who would like to share any memories about Charlie, please feel free. Yeah, uh, but before we get started, there were several items that were missing from Charlie's dressing room when his widow Alice cleaned it out. She would especially like back his gold pocket watch. It plays the Yellow Rose of Texas at the top of every hour. Yeah, can we move this along a little bit? It's about 2 o'clock. <laughs> well, at least get me an actor who looks like it from the back, okay? We're not reshooting the whole freaking thing. <laughs> People used to say that Charlie Stevens had a big heart. Well, it turns out they were right. It was enlarged. <laughs> That's what killed him. <laughs> One need only look at Charlie's resume to know the kind of man this he is, was. This is terrific stuff, Grant. The, the genius Happy of this is how you have Connor Jackie Wilson so show. distraught he can't show any emotion at all. Yeah, I figured that would play right into Jackie's main Mark strength as an actor. <laughs> <laughs> What are you yakking about back there? Show a little consideration, all right? Uh oh. We're just, we're just sharing some fond memories about Charlie. Memories. Yeah, memories. Hey, Harper, lighten up a little bit, man. It's a funeral, for God's sakes. <laughs> As I was about to say, Charlie Stevens was a man of many virtues. I feel safe in saying that I love that man. As much as management can ever love an employee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let somebody else share. What can I say about Charlie? Well, he wasn't a mean drunk. If he had any faults at all, it was his constant womanizing. He had a special way with animals, which is why he could never go back to Kansas. Seriously, folks. They say that dying is easy, comedy is hard. Well, Charlie could do both. That takes talent. So let's give one final round of applause to Charlie, a good man, a funny man, a dead man. <laughs> fumes are a little thick in here. You want me to crack a window or something? Really? What fumes? <laughs> Mr. Thomas, you wanted to see us, sir. Yeah, Bill, finish the script. I want you to type it up, read it, and tell me what I think about it. Great, where is it? Right here. Jeez, Jack, you shouldn't you open a window in here? Hey, mind your own business, lady. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what do you guys think of my trophy case? Oh. Uh, it's great. What are, you, what are you gonna put in it? Ha! Ah. He's right here, man. That way, when I win my Emmy, uh, people won't think it's a fluke. You know? <laughs> oh, that one there, that, that, that I'm most proud of. The one with the pig on the top? Yeah. Yeah, I got that down at the meatpacking plant for chugging a bucket of entrails. <laughs> you know, they mean a lot more to you when you actually earn them. So you didn't win this Tony for cats? <laughs> Don't be stupid, Jerry. I'm allergic to cats. <laughs> Can I get paid now? Yeah, Laura, why don't you cut him a check or something? Sure. Uh, could you make that cash? I, uh, kind of lost my ID. Yeah, I'm sure that you're anxious to get on your way. In fact, Jerry could drive you to the edge of town. Oh, oh hey, that won't be necessary. I, I talked Bill into staying until after the tape, and I think he wants to see his words come to life. What? What about that drug guy that was after you? He got shot. <laughs> I'm in the clear. <laughs> What makes us all the same is that we're all different. And for us individuals, AT&T introduces the iPlan, long distance that fits the way you live because it's based on your life. I is for calling plans without complications, people who speak your language, and doing things that used to be impossible from almost anywhere on Earth. Imagine having your own iPlan. I is for individual, only from AT&T. In a world that's moving very fast, we can find balance in our days and in our diets with foods like Dan and Yogurt that put back what the world takes out of us. 
Dannon yogurt, deliciously creamy, nutrient dense, which means in very few calories we get a lot of nutrition. Calcium, potassium, real yogurt cultures, and the sense that there's a place in each day where we can find balance. Dannon yogurt, a very healthy habit for life. You know those credit card commercials where they tell you to jaunt off to some exotic paradise? This isn't one of them, okay? We're taking our MasterCard to the supermarket. How's that for exotic? Actually, I guess it is kind of exotic. I mean, you've got a MasterCard, they've got tropical fruit and crystal clear water, right? And now, no card is more accepted on the planet, including supermarkets. And it's smart to use your monthly statement to keep track of your grocery spending. I mean, the supermarket isn't exactly paradise, but at least you can drink the water. MasterCard, it's more than a credit card. It's smart money. Having a real estate license doesn't necessarily mean that you know how to sell real estate. You have to understand people. I do a lot of interaction with my clients, and I listen to what they have to say. The biggest pleasure for me to be able to get them into that house, and they thought I was the greatest thing in the world because I could do that. There isn't anything any school could teach you to make you care about people. That's got to come from the heart. Century 21, rated best at customer service. Life is people, and the more you give, the more you get. Nope, you can't program your VCR. Your favorite shows end up looking like this. Or this. Or worse, like this. Maybe you should talk to your remote. This man does. Friday, 8.30 p.m. Tonight from the Night File, we'll show you the latest gadget to help you take control of your VCR. Is it the voice of the future? Find out when Ron Golubin reports for the Night File. Tonight at 11 on News Center 5. Well, you got to give Bill credit. He found a rhyme for aneurysm. <laughs> Looks like Bill put a lot of sweat into this. I hope it's sweat. I hate this. This is a slap in the face to struggle. Oh, what was it? Wait, 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 wait. I wasn't going to make the car wash speech. Although it is apropos. <laughs> stop, all right, stop, 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 stop looking at this. We are not, we are not handing in this script. We are handing in Grant's script and we're gonna take our lumps. Hey, 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 wait, what do you mean we pale face? Jerry, <laughs> you can't do this. Bill is gonna be at the taping. He'll rat you out. That's what he does. I don't care. I'm with you, Jerry. My script is a much better tribute to Charlie. I, I poured my soul into that thing. Who knows what Bill poured into that? <laughs> I, I agree with Grant. We owe it to Grant to produce his script because yeah. he's not getting credit uh -huh. and he's not getting paid. 100%. I'm not getting paid? <laughs> Jerry, you are so selfish. What? You know that if you hand in the script that Jackie is going to fire you, and I need you. <laughs> we need you here because you are really, you're a really good writer, and you make my job as producer a lot easier with you here, you know, than not here. Shut up, Bobby. <laughs> really? Well, I am not having my name associated with the ramblings of a drug addict. Well, show's almost over. Has Bill said anything to anyone? No, but he doesn't look happy. Of course, security did take away his bottle and his gun. <laughs> I want you to make me cry. Make me feel your pain. Yeah, well, maybe after the show, you freak. But right now, I've got a scene to do. Shh, 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 shh. Okay. Action. It's been a week since Charlie's death, Jackie. You have to stop blaming yourself. But I caused his death. Don't you see? I was the one that was chasing him. God, why him and not me? <laughs> It's with us. It is. Why don't you tell him now? Oh, oh Charlie. Charlie, it's your old buddy, Jackie. Charlie, there's something I never told you. I I I <laughs> Jackie, Jackie, you've got to say it loud. Remember, he was deaf in one ear. Okay.
Will somebody figure out where that noise is coming from and put a stop to it? Cut, cut. Let's reset and do it again. Laura? Oh, it's a beautiful thing, Jerry. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. It's a 35 share easy. Oh, have a mug. Oh, thanks. Hey, guys, did you see me out there crying for Charlie? Oh, yeah. And I didn't hardly know the guy. I mean, that was good acting. I'm going to win that Emmy. You know what? If I don't, next time we kill Helen. <laughs> Jackie, the reason that this is so effective is because the actor actually died. You're reading my mind. Lights fall, sets topple over, stuff happens. Well, well, maybe we should kill you. That'll really bring in the ratings. That's a great idea, Jerry. But let's do it next year. Well, it'll be the season opener. <laughs> Uh-oh. Here comes Peter Cottonmouth. <laughs> Jerry, looks like this is the moment of reckoning. You know, you guys have always meant a lot to me, so I want you to have this as a show of affection. Bye. Yeah, uh, Bill. 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 Mm. Bill. Hey, Bill, what's going on, buddy? You look a little upset. I am upset. There's something been bugging me all night. What? Well, they told me down to payroll I couldn't get any rerun money up front. I mean, I gotta meet a guy. <laughs> It's not about crap or anything like oh, that. Oh, no, 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 no. Hey, Laura, yeah. I want you to look into this for Bill. Well, actually, I think you have to wait until the episode reruns. Well, who knows if I'm going to be alive then? <laughs> That's a good point. Hey, Laura, make it happen for him. Uh, Bill, 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 so you're happy with the way things are going? Can you keep a secret? Sure, yeah. Uh, I was a little messed up when I was writing it. Ah, uh, no. Yeah. The only thing I remember is, uh, bats coming out of the wall, like... <laughs> That's a close one. <laughs> Say, you don't know where I would go to get my gun, do you? <laughs> hey, keep my eye on you. Oh, one of Big Tony's guys, right? <laughs> no, I'm Doug Talbot with the network. Oh. You know, we're always looking for new talent, and I think yeah. we might just have a pilot for you to write. Hmm? It's another one of those comeback vehicles for Shelley Long. Sure. <laughs> Listen, can you help me get my gun? I'd love to pop one of those bats. <laughs> hey, Bobby. Yeah, what well, do me favor? Scratch Danny McLean's name off my Cy Young Award there. <laughs> Pretty good episode last week, huh? huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. That Bill's a very talented addict. Yeah. yeah. I was thinking of getting some more of my buddies from Detox to write scripts. What? Uh, you know, Jackie, I really think that Bill was just that one in a million find. No, 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 no. Bill's just a run-of-the-mill crackhead. Actually, there was this one guy in there, Heroin Hank. You know, he used to sit around all day pounding his head on the wall. <laughs> he was so funny. Well, <laughs> if, if you want to know the truth, uh, Jerry. You remember that old saying about confession being bad for the soul? Hey, I know what. We could put Harold and Hank on staff here. He could write with you guys. As a matter of fact, he could live here because he's homeless now. You got locks on all the drawers, right? No, 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 no. We, we're not hiring Heroin Hank or Opium Otis or Cocaine Carl. What do you got against Cocaine Carl, man? He has paid his dues. Bill did not write that script. Oh, how come I'm always the last one to know what goes on around here? I wrote the script. I wrote it. Jeez, but I told them to. So if you're going to fire anybody, fire me. Fire me. But, but, but as long as I'm here, we are not hiring any more of your buddies. <laughs> I'm not going to fire you, Jerry. You're too damn much fun, buddy. I was just pulling your leg, man. <laughs> you should have seen yourself. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I knew Bill didn't write that. Well, how did you know that? Well, when you guys didn't fight me on hiring him too much, I knew something was up. And then I only heard that stupid car wash story once. <laughs> There's no way Bill could have written that script. The man has lost his mind. <laughs> did you, then why did you put us through all this? Why? <laughs> why do guys tear the wings off butterflies? <laughs> that Jackie is actually getting smarter? Hey, anybody remember why I got hands written on my hand? <laughs> hey, it's 
stick around while I slip into something more comfortable. Wait, I'm already nude! Mm. Once you discover that Kellogg's Frosted Flakes have always been fat-free, you may find they taste even better. Mm. <laughs> fat-free Kellogg's Frosted Flakes. They're great! These days, people who want to save money on lunch are brown-bagging it. Because McDonald's original hamburger is still just 59 cents. Our delicious cheeseburger is 69 cents. And that is no baloney. She knew that Max Factor's 2,000 calorie mascara would fatten her lashes. But then what? The waiter's stare as she ordered dinner suggested that he was preoccupied with something. She wondered what. But when he asked her what kind of dressing she would like on her lashes, his Freudian slip told her exactly what was on his mind. In In 2,000 calorie mascara fattens lashes more than 200%. Lashes that get noticed. Impact. Max Factor International. It's the comedy event of the season. I really look nice tonight. With appearances by Whoopi Goldberg, Eddie Murphy, Jerry Seinfeld, and more. The American Comedy Awards Wednesday. Say, what I miss? Ted Danson won for Best Actor. Yeah. Jackie was halfway up to the podium before the guards grabbed him. <laughs> Idiot wasn't even nominated. <laughs> for outstanding writing in a comedy series, and the winner is... <laughs> Bill Mason, The Jackie Thomas Show, for the episode, Charlie Bites the Big One. <laughs> Rob, uh, you know, that should be you staggering up those stairs in that oddly stained tuxedo. I hate that this is an insult to struggling oh, right now. Shut up! up. Next on Cops. Just a sec. Just, just a sec. Ow! What are you doing, man? Hey, hey, I don't live here. Hey, I'm just hot sitting there. No, oh, come on. Hey, I'm framed. This is a frame up. You don't got you know, names? You guys want names? No. Oh, I know all the names. All the way up to the top. What can I get? What do you need? What do you need? Ha, 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 ha.